Welcome to Soul Horoscope Zodiac Weather. My name is Christopher Watecki, and I'm your stand-up astrologer. It's now Wednesday, June 9, 2010. The sun's progressed to 18 degrees Gemini, and the moon today has shifted into Taurus. Let's take a look at those planets. Well, today it's an exciting day, a day of paradigm shift. Seems to be the mantra these days. Really triggered by this. A glorious soul pyramid in Earth. Now, soul pyramid is a grand trine in classic astrology. The epicenter is the moon here in Taurus. So the moon is our emotions. The moon is where we're kind of learning from. So in each of your horoscopes, we'll be talking about, at the end of the day, it's an emotional perspective that is going to change. But what you're trining into this is uh, Mars direct in Virgo, so taking actions now with Mars in Virgo, and up to Pluto retrograde in Capricorn. So we're going to feel a new way. We're going to take action in Virgo, and as a result, we're going to reconsider our position with Pluto and Capricorn. On top of that, the Sun. Today, ruled by Mars, so that means we're going to also, at the end of the day, take some steps in the Gemini vibration. So, in each of your horoscopes, I'll be getting kind of deep on this one, about how that soul pyramid shifts your awareness and probably is the agent that frees you to take action or or vice versa. You're going to take action and that's going to release the soul pyramid. But before you click on your full horoscope, let's take a look at the moods of each of your brothers and sisters and where that emotional shift will be. And let's start now with those air signs. Gemini, cloudy, rather irritable probably for at least the first half of the day, but you're going to find that you have an inner faith metamorphosis. So that irritability leads to faith in my opinion. The Librans, Starting with a chance of feeling frisky, and your paradigm shift is boundaries and borders will reform. So you're going to change your boundary issues in life. And the Aquarius is sunny and relaxing today, and with that soul pyramid, you're making a security modification. So you're going to modify your security, and at the end of the day, I think, feel more nurtured. Now let's check out those fire signs. Very sunny and rather productive. By the end of the day, I think you're going to raise your prices and really put your heart behind your values. The, uh, the Leos. Sunny and professional. For you, it's a career reshaping that happens with your emotions shifting and taking steps in society. And the Sagittarius is sunny, hyper aware of your moment to moment, but your shift is in the new reality you feel on the horizon, Sagittarius. Now on to those earth signs. Taurus, sunny and feeling cool. The moon is, after all, in their sign. And your change will be a turn in your ego. So maybe a new perspective, new way of presenting yourself, bull. The Virgos, sunny and rather passionate, though it is a significant epiphany in your understanding of life. So Virgos are going to use all that processing, get deep, and become super aware. And the Capricorns, sunny, rather childlike, at least by the end of the day, and you find a new opportunity for joy with this grand trine in Earth. Then lastly, the H2Os. Cancer, sunny, feeling social. I do think you're going to have a social life revision, so you're going to reinvent yourself out there in the world. The Scorpios, sunny, rather affectionate with their partnerships today, and I think you're going to have a new outlook on marriage altogether. And the Pisces, sunny, hyperactive mind going on for the fish, but your ship will be a fresh perspective on life. So it's all good and all positive for all Zodiac races. Okay, that's all I have for today's Zodiac weather. Of course, click on your horoscope, get the details of that grand trine. And we're out there under a nice, stable, not stubborn, moon in Taurus. Well, I'm in the studio covering your astro. Ooh.